Hey guys, Dude here, and I'm going to be doing my personal review of XSplit Broadcaster. Now, how this review is going to work is I'm going to be comparing this to uh, Open Broadcaster software, which is what I currently use to record games. Basically just going off of what I personally need in a recording software, so don't get mad at me if I say something you don't like. I like XSplit, I really do. The thing I want to go on into is the UI. The UI is very, very polished, very clean, I love it. Uh, comparing this to Open Broadcaster, shit. Um, I haven't played around with scenes much in OBS, so... Maybe it's similar, you just gotta make it that way. XSplit is definitely more polished and something you can have more control over the scenes, I assume. I haven't fiddled around with it much in that regard, because I don't stream, which I might as well go into the chroma key feature. Um, if Yogscast uses it like I think they do, it looks very nice. Very nice, like, good job, guys. I love it. I don't stream, though, and I don't have a webcam or a green screen behind me when I play games, so there's really no point to, for me to use that. Both programs export to MP4, which I love. In fact, XSplit gives the option to export to FLV, which is definitely a plus in my book. One gripe I have, you can choose to boost by however many decibels your system volume or your microphone volume. Now, I'm very quiet, like, I have a fan going, and right now, my microphone is set to a low setting, so hopefully you won't hear the, mic the fan as much. But, uh, I could not find that on Broadcaster. I couldn't find that on Gamecaster either, but what I could do is lower the system volume enough to where you could still kind of hear me if I happen to boost the volume, which I could probably do in post-production, but that's, what my, that's my one little gripe about it. Overall, I can definitely see why people use XSplit, but if you're recording like me and just need something that's free, I would recommend Open Broadcaster, but if you're streaming with a webcam, I could not recommend XSplit any more than I already do for that. Um, I would definitely buy it if I went into streaming and definitely had a webcam. That said, I'd like to thank Freedom Network, George, and XSplit for letting me review this. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next game. Bye!